Greetings, everybody. BJ Weller back with you for another wonderful Monday afternoon. Well, actually, it's morning for me, but hey, depending on where you are, it could be afternoon, it could be evening, it could be night, it could be the wee hours of the morning. And I want to thank every single one of you, one and all, for joining me here, for uh, hanging out with me today. It is, ooh, I know, I, so much there. Um, it is much appreciated. I, I appreciate the support, whether you subscribe, whether you cheer, whether you follow, whether you just hang out and chat, or you just hang out and lurk. Uh, it doesn't matter. I appreciate everyone who uh, comes to support me by being here and watching the channel. It is uh, it is great fun to be able to do this uh, and to do this in the way we're doing it, really, and have uh, people out there entertained. Uh, as long as uh, I can keep entertaining everyone, um, I'm going to keep doing it and having fun with it. Um, so if you're entertained, please uh, be sure to uh, let all your friends know and uh, keep joining us here as we try to stick to our, our schedule as much as possible. I think we're going to be in good shape now. Uh, we sort of got things sort of under control. We still got some real life stuff going on that needs to be taken care of here and there. But um, I think we're in good shape to maintain our pattern. Although Mondays might be changing. Um, in December, we might end up actually streaming more uh, in the evening than during the daytime on Mondays again, due to some real life scheduling that needs to be changed because of you know holidays and you know retail and all that kind of stuff, the day job and all that good stuff. But uh, we'll see how things go. And of course, if it gets changed, always follow, uh, always check out our channel feed down below the live stream window here for for all the latest updates and happenings for what's going on week to week. Uh, with our stream and everything else. But in the meantime, let's get on with it. Uh, we're running a little bit late to, again today because, you know, there's some real life stuff going on. And uh, we had we had a homework uh, project. We had a school project emergency this morning uh, that had to be taken care of. So uh, uh, that's what uh, sort of caused us to be a little late today. But anyway, let's uh, let's get on with a little bit of Zoo Tycoon here. I didn't want to have to miss out on building some of our abby boo zoo you know what i'm saying there so uh let's rock the rolls as our zoo loads oh i do have to say uh congratulations too uh, by the way to our good uh streaming buddy and judgment gaming uh team leader and fellow extra lifer um Battery H. Uh, I just saw on Twitter before I went on here as I was tweeting out that I was going to start the stream. Um, um, that the Battery H uh, apparently has made affiliate uh, on streaming. So his his marathon and a couple other this a uh, couple of the other streams that he did uh, has given him the ability to become a Twitch affiliate. So uh, definitely. Uh, Heartfelt congratulations to Battery for making affiliate and uh, joining the club. Joining the club here of us Twitch streamers who have made affiliate and just enjoy doing it. Hey, Tasmanian has made it too. Hey, hey, long time since I was on stream now. I had two busy weekends. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Believe me, I know what that feels like. But hey, it's glad to see you back. All good. Oh, you know what? I... I forgot to upload our Stronghold Kingdom stream uh, on YouTube. I wanted to do that before I went live today. Oh, well, we're going to be running a little bit behind on our YouTube upload, so I'll have to get that up today, uh, later on today. But, yeah, I know the busyness, yeah. <laughs> and it's only going to get worse for me and uh, Mrs. Weiler here uh, this week <laughs> for the next about six weeks or so. But, hey, thanks for joining me today. I was just mentioning that uh, I think Battery, uh, if, if everything looks the way it should look, Battery is made affiliate. Uh, so I'm really excited about that for my good friend Battery H there. He is now a Twitch affiliate. We can uh, cheer for him and we can subscribe to him. So I have to uh, I have to make it a point to uh, catch his next stream. I think he may be streaming Wednesday evening. Uh, so I definitely have to make a point to be on stream so we, I can congratulate him and uh get some cheers in and uh get get a subscription going his way because obviously you know battery h is is our uh, dedicated subscriber right here so uh i definitely have to return the favor now that i can but that's awesome stuff so that that perked me up today that cheered me up today when i saw that on twitter uh he's got he, he mentioned that he has to come up with some channel emotes i'm like hmm that sounds interesting it sounds like somebody made affiliate 
and indeed he did because when I popped over to his channel he got your nice little subscribe button up there and you got your bits uh, button so it was coolness so that's awesome 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 because uh, he's I enjoy watching his streams he does some he does some good stuff probably better than I could ever do it but you know that's life we're here to have fun so let's uh, our 43rd Murkat has died of old age. Well, already then. That should clear out some room in that pen. Hmm. But yeah, it was, a, it, it was a very quiet Friday afternoon for our Stronghold Kingdom stream. But that's okay. It was, uh, it's just been one of those weeks, one of those months, really. It's just been a pain in the butt. Yeah, go battery. Indeed, indeed, indeed. <laughs> All right, this was, um, hmm. Who was this animal supposed to be? Because where are they? This is supposed to be our lemur. Did all our lemurs escape? Let's zoom in here and uh, walk around. Oh my god, Keeper Ford. My zoo keepers are terrible. Oh, no, there they are. Okay, they're just chilling. So let's say that would that would highly irritate me. So there's our lemurs. Oh, look at that. You're pulling the Hershey. That's what Hershey does. <laughs> she makes her little nest on our uh, on our uh, microfiber blankets or whatever they are. Plops down the rest. Okay, good. So our lemurs are alive and well. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Yes, Empress out. I was out. Megan stole off Miss Her. Yeah, I know. I, I hope everything's okay with her. I mean, that's... And she's... I mean, you know, even with everything going on, she was pretty good about checking in and let us know how everything was going. So not, not to hear from her for a couple of months now at this point is... Uh, that's kind of worrying. So I hope everything's okay with her and nothing... Nothing happened that we uh, that that we need to uh, worry about or anything like that. You know, it's just uh, hopefully it's just her trying to get things back in order um, down there. But uh, yeah, that's that's what I'm worried about. That no news is bad news. So I, I hope it's just you know her trying to get things in order and put priorities where they are. But like I said, you know, without not hearing anything from her, that I mean that that's that's kind of troubling to me. And just to be sitting here, and you know, where you're, you're off in Belgium, up here, and I'm up here on the northeast. It's, you know, it's not like, hey, let's let's take a road trip down there and make sure Megan's okay. You know, we, you know, we can't really do anything to check on her except hope and pray that everything's okay with her. Uh, so let's get out of here. So, so hopefully, hopefully. Yeah, but yeah, I don't like the fact that she hasn't even, you know, checked in just to say, hey, still here, hanging in. But we got to keep, uh, we got to keep the, uh, yeah, you know, yeah, you have no idea. Yeah, we, all we know is Houston. We don't even know her real name. We All we know is Megan. Do, 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 do. Yeah, because I had uh, I had DM'd her on um, Discord a couple weeks ago, just to say, hey, you know, just want to make sure everything's okay with you. Check in, you know, just let us know that you're okay. And I haven't heard anything, which again, you know, is kind of troubling. But oh, we got some angry guests here. Oh, you're hungry. Oh my god, you're, you are you need to go potty. You need food and you're not happy about it. Okay, well, kid, come here. Let's help you out here. Let's uh, plop you down by the restroom here. There you go. Good, you go potty. Oh, you're doing the pee-pee dance. Kid. You need me to take you in there? <sighs> I 
Oh, uh, let's see. We uncover the fossilized piece of the dwarf Sicilian elephant. Ah, Don Elephant. Don Gulion. Same here. At least once a week I contacted her, but never an answer. Yeah, so. Hey, um, is that Abby? <laughs> It's a troll too. Yeah, she she's out there. She's out there playing. She actually ate breakfast fairly decently. She's out there playing in the mess in our living room. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. The kid there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Kid's trolling me. That that she is. All right. So okay. Uh, cheetah Cheetah One is really hungry. Why are you really hungry? Um. I guess I should just fire all my zookeepers because they are just doing a terrible job. Alright, let's, um... We got some meat there. Alright, well, you know what? Let me throw down, um... Throw down some more meat for you. I'll throw it. I'll throw it out here. There you go. Might as well uh, give you something to eat there. Now you can just go there. Go eat. Go eat the meat. You're just gonna troll me too, huh? You're just gonna walk away from it, aren't you? Oh, oh, oh! Hang on, hang on. There we go. That a girl. Or, uh, what, what are you particularly, by the way? Um, hmm. You are... What are you? You're a male. There, atta boy. Atta boy. You eat, you, you eat up there. Ah, uh, you're a happy, happy cheetah now. That's what we like to see. We like happy animals. I'm going to start, uh, listening only going to make the USA unsafe. Oh, boy. Sounds like a little American truck simulator going on there. I just bought my truck this morning. Bought my truck this morning, and got in got in my first uh, first double trailer run. So uh, we're good. It, it's nice though. Uh, look, I, I was worried whether I'd have a two. You know, two weeks sounds like a lot of time, but for me, that's not a whole lot of time. But uh, it looks like all I really need to do is get ten runs in, and uh, I'll have that achievement done. So that 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 really should be no problem. <laughs> So yeah, I've got I, I've got a backlog of some uh, ATS videos I got to get up on YouTube now. In addition to I got a Euro Truck Two one to get up and the Train Sim one to get up. So I got a whole backlog of videos to upload in addition to the Stronghold Kingdoms one. But yeah, it's pretty. Uh, it's, I now I have to get used to actually driving my own truck, uh, and you know because I'm so used to doing the quick jobs where it's bang you pick up the job. You don't have to worry about resting unless you've got one of the long hauls. Um, you just go, you generally don't have to worry about gas. Now it's like, oh, I got, I got to go actually go pick up my trailer now attached to the trailer. So wherever I am, I got to go there and I got to go drop it off and make sure I get rest now. Cause there's no rest in between jobs. I got to rest manually. Got to make sure I have enough gas. That's nice. I really, I, I, I did, uh, I actually did two runs this morning. One of them was a heavy haul. Um, and then the other one was the double trailer one. And, uh, I was quite pleased, quite pleased with with how my truck performed. Even if I'm not quite the... Uh, oh, crap. How did you get out, dude? Seriously. Okay, let's... Uh, let's pick you up. Let's get you back in the pen here. How the heck did you get out of the pen? That's all we need. A velociraptor on a loose... A super velociraptor! Uh, <laughs> no less. Wow, you are quite the clever little uh, bird dinosaur type thing there, aren't you? Where's your pal? Is your pal in here? Wow, your your pal is not in there either. Looks like you can reach it just fine. But just in case, I'm going to move it up. I'm going to move it over here. There we go. How's that? Next to the food. And I have no idea where the other Velociraptor went. 
Oh, there it is. Okay, there's one. Oh, that was the other one. I think that's it. That's the regular one. Okay, that's the regular one. All right. You can't reach it. Okay, so there is... What is that, an egg? What's this? It's an egg. Ooh. Oh. We, we have a Velociraptor baby on the way. Well, goody, goody, goody. Now, where are you? You can reach... Okay, you can reach your food dish now. All right, you can't reach the turtle. You can't reach our little baby turtle there. So where are you, Keeper Ford? Where are you, Keeper Ford? And why can't you reach the turtle? So let's see. Oh, you're really hungry, are you? All right, well, let's go. Uh, let's pop in here and take care of our turtle anyway. Go to Santa Fe, the course and see now, just over a thousand miles. Yeah, I haven't. I don't think I've unlocked the, the long jobs yet. Uh, I, I'll, I'm going to wait to do that. I, I'm, I'm starting to level. I, I maxed out um, high value. Uh, now I'm starting to work on uh, the fragile cargo. Although I haven't had a fragile <laughs> load yet to haul, so I think most of them are because most of the, the best paying jobs right now are the heavy cargo jobs. So they've been the ones I've been running. Daddy. Yes. I'm streaming Why? because that's what I do I to hopefully one day make a little bit of money so I can, you know, I do you want to do that? Well, you got to wait till you're a little bit older. Yeah. Technically, you're not allowed until you're 13. You can touch your computer. I'll just touch it. No, you can't touch my computer Why? That could, because that would cause some problems. <laughs> that would not be good. Problems are not good. Taz says hi. Why? Because I won't let you touch my computer? No. Why don't you go get your stuff and you can sit with me? No, I don't want to. Well, you got quite the attitude, don't you? Boy, if you don't get your way, if she don't get her way, she gets an attitude like you would not believe. <laughs> I right, go drink some water. I'm going to pop in here. Oh, hello. Uh, hi, turtle. You're hungry. I know. I've got to find your food. I, I have no idea where... Is this your food? Okay, let's replenish the lettuce. There you go. Oh, i got to heal you. Okay, you're not doing too well. Oh, well, look. It's the zookeeper. Yeah, come on. Um, guess, love you. well, that's good, but I've got a very sick baby turtle here, and... Those high value jobs will pay the best always. Yes, indeed. And that helped. I, you know, do, do, you know, I only had to, I didn't really have to run a whole many of them. Uh, you know, I think altogether, I think I got 25 of the quick jobs done. So, and I, I you know, after I started leveling up the high, high value, that really, uh, you know, 30,000 bucks a job for not too long of a distance either was not, uh, was not too bad. So that, that, that helped a bit. So I was able to buy my tr buy my truck and upgrade the stock model uh, to just the way I, uh, I sort of wanted it. So it worked out very well. Likely, I only drive the heavy haul trailers over eighty thousand pounds. You know, like I said, you know, we, you know, based on your suggestion to do the the, the price per mile, it's like that's essentially with you know the the first couple of pages are all the heavy haul jobs. Oh, you got your 170,000. Yeah, I was looking at that saying, oh, well, that should be an easy one to get, but I haven't had any um I haven't had any jobs that were 170,000 pounds yet. So, I did complete the um I did complete the uh the 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 one that does each of the each of the heavy each of the uh, pieces of equipment that count the nine pieces of equipment uh for the heavy haul. I think it was, and it, whatever the achievement's called, it's like, oh, and uh, I thought this, I thought this was supposed to be heavy, that achievement or whatever, so I knocked that one off last night, which was nice. Oh, you're not happy either. You want some snacks, huh? All right, so I think, oh, we got garbage on the ground there. Wow. I'm, I'm essentially going to have to run my, my zoo myself here. All right, let's replenish that. All right, looks like you're okay. Make sure my turtle's okay before I leave here. Uh, let's do this. Okay, so she's. Oh, you fell. Aurora, cool. Excellent. 
Alright, good. So it looks like that's fine. That's fine. All right, good, 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 good. Now, now, once I get this ATS achievement over, I can uh, start working on uh, earning my truck in uh, Euro Two. That'll be that'll be the next step. Uh, that is total truck weight. My cargo was 123 pounds transformed. I have the biggest truck. Oh, okay. With 233 gallons of diesel in the tank, I only got oh okay. I'm trying to think, um, I'm trying to think what's how, how many gallons my truck was. I know I upgraded to the 500 horsepower engine and, and uh, upgraded the tranny on it, and I know out of the four that I was able to get because I'm I'm still only level 10, so I wasn't able to get the level 13 one that I had my eye on, but I was able to upgrade the level eight uh, Kenworth, the W900. Uh, I was able to upgrade that one to like a sleeper, studio sleeper, upgrade the engine, the transmission on it. Um, I don't remember, and it, that one had had a bigger bigger fuel tank on it too, than the other ones I was able to to purchase at that point. I forget how many gallons it was. Well, Cheetah Six, you're you're just gonna have to hold on there because uh, my tank is 300 gallons. Yeah, I'm trying to. Th yeah, I don't remember. I think it was like 200, 250, something like that. I don't want to say, but I'm not sure. All right, so let's um, yeah, my I think it was two hundred. That's probably what it was. Uh, all right, so let's. I lost my train of thought here. Um, mm -hmm. oh yes, you know what we're gonna have to do? We're gonna have to. Ooh, I've got to go in there. I've got some fossilized diggings to dig up, but we'll take care of that later. What I need to do. I guess is throw down some more um, some more food stuffs here. I mean, I don't necessarily want to throw down another restaurant yet. I want to. Um, hmm. Do 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 do. do. I mean, we got the cart there. I mean, we're not too far here. Um, uh, all right, you know what? Let's see what we got in terms of food. I don't know if I threw down, threw down the compost building yet. Uh, staff center we got. Those are the restrooms. We got. I think we got most of that stuff out on the one side over there. Let's see here. Pony rides. Hey, most of it are just the food stands that we got here. And there's the rest, fancy restaurant, restaurant, family restaurant. I think that's what I've got right now is the family restaurant here. And that's the gift shop. Where? Oh, my restaurant's over here, you fool. Hey, me fool. So, okay, that's the family restaurant. Which is actually our only restaurant, I think. I'd, uh, so let's just do that family restaurant. Boop. Okay. Uh, let me see here. Wish I could get a, a complete overview of the zoo. Yes, yeah, see, there's a lot. If I, I probably will add another restaurant, but I don't want to add. It'll probably be way over here in the opposite corner here. I think it would make a little bit more sense. Nothing. Up here, we just have to be food stands here. So let's see what food stands I got right now. Oh my god, the pea fowl was pregnant. So do we got hot dog. That's the restroom. So let's see what we got here. We got coffee, subs, hamburger, soda. Okay. And that's pretty much it. Do I have the insect house? Oh, maybe I don't have the insect house. All right, well. What I'm going to do then is, uh, I don't have anything over here. 
throw the restaurant there. So we don't really have too much food. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll be able to throw the food cart or something down here. So what we want to do then, uh, let's work on this area of the zoo. And you know what? I think this is where we're going to want our aquatic animals. we still got the little toy there we dug up a couple of... Uh, couple of episodes ago so we'll definitely want to put that into a seal tank and so let's see I sort of want to come off into here so let's do that let's throw the pathway down for the moment so I can get a general idea of where I kind of want stuff to go here I think that's good. If I lead off this way, that'll be good for uh, small exhibits on either side here. And then like our food stands and stuff can go like right down here. Some more food stands. So let's do this. So we've got... I want carts. Uh, I want some stands here. So let's see what we haven't put down yet food stand wise let's start here so we got the hamburger stand and the hot dog sure we don't have shish kebab yet shish kebab so let's do shish kebab here oops make sure i rotate it in the right direction so we're going to put you you know what? let's put you right here All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm going to have to adopt out some cheetahs. I need to find my cave lion now. So let's go here. Oh, we're losing some fame here. I don't know why you can't find the food trough. I mean, it's right there. Cave lion one. All right, looks like you found it well enough. We got some meat there. We got that. So let's... Pick that up. How about we, uh, let's put that there. Okay, let's move this here. There go. Oh, come on. There we go, zookeeper. There we go. All right, maybe that'll help a little bit. Cheetah's giving birth. Okay, so, uh, whew. so we're going to have to work on our cheetahs, but let's get this over with first. Okay. All right, so let's see where we were at here. Let's uh, zoom in here a bit more. Here we go. All right, so this is a shish kebab. Now let's put down our sushi. Where is the sushi? Sushi food stand here. Salad. Oh, we'll definitely do salad too. Sushi. You'll go there. We'll do salad. There. What else we got here? We got coffee. We'll probably do coffee again. Coffee, coffee, soda, water. We'll do a water. We'll do the water there. Okay. So we got some food stands there. So I think what we'll do now, uh, we definitely need a restroom over in this area. Just some notes to myself there for when I do the highlight and editing. All right, so let's bring our path a little bit further up that way. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's go back here. So good. So let's see where our restrooms are at here. They were up towards this end here. Okay, family restroom, small restroom. I think we'll want another family restroom up this way. Oops. Well, 
on it. Yeah, I guess I'll put it on this side here. There we go. So we're good there. We'll do. We'll throw. We'll throw another. Throw another. Another coffee stand in here. For Mrs. Weiler here. She loves her coffee. So we'll we'll throw in another coffee stand right here. Oh, where are you? There we go. All right, good. So we've got that. So what we'll want to do now is get, let's get some benches and stuff in here. Uh, obviously some trash cans and recycling. Uh, zoo map. Where's our map here? I know that the cheetahs need more space. I, I don't know what to tell you about that. Uh, I'd like to put the zoom out there, but then that uh, sort of cuts me off pathwise, so that's not going to work. Um, so let me do this first, because uh, the path is going to cut back down this way, so let's do that. So the path is going to be coming down this way towards more exhibits. We're going to be going that way as well. And then we'll go around. We'll maybe have something here, but let's do a zoom map first. We'll put the zoom map right there. Now we want some benches and stuff for people to sit down on. Some more tables here in this area. Put a bench here, put a bench here, there we go. Alright, I like that. Alright, I like that. Alright, now let's go take care of our cheetahs. Uh, first things first, so let's do this. Save the game. We'll save the game right there. Yes, let's overwrite that. Okay. Gotta think now. I, I have such a hankering to do a simulating reality stream now. You gotta figure out where I would uh, fit that in on the schedule. You'd probably have to cut something out. What you doing here, Abs? I so want to start streaming those games. But I am gonna. I am definitely going to try to do a 12-hour stream. In December, probably Christmas Eve, Christmas weekend. I think Christmas is what uh, Sun fr uh, Monday. Christmas Eve is f Sunday, so I might end up doing a 12-hour stream on the 23rd. Uh, we'll be playing the uh, all three truck games in the train train simulator. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it works out that way. Okay, cheetahs. I gotta go find the cheetahs. Uh, I gotta stop distracting myself and uh, get to the job at hand here. Marquette 55 was pregnant. Oh my god. Oh my god, he had it was breeding like rabbits, and I don't even have rabbits in the zoo. All right, you guys said you were a little squeezed for space here. Let's see. Oh, you need... Oh, look at that. You're getting your bath. Speak of the devil. Space, critical space. I can't... You guys are boxed in now. I can't get you more space unless I can open that up a little bit. But I mean, there's too many of you. I've got to adopt you out. I don't want to adopt my original cheetahs out, so maybe I'll adopt. Let's uh, let's adopt you out. Uh, let's see, where's the rest of you guys here? Uh, oh, I forgot. There's no key to get in there. At least I don't know what the key is. If there is, so you're eating. I just don't know where the rest of you guys are. Where are you? Uh, 
Oh, the bison are breeding. Now I only okay. There's some more of you. Right, you're all just chilling under the tree. So let's see where we're at here. Cheetah two. We want to hold on to you. Uh, if we have any big cheetah eight, okay, we will definitely put you up for adoption. Cheetah seven. So I think well, cheetah eight technically was the youngest. We just gave him up or her up, whatever the case may be. Uh, that's right. You look you look like you're still kind of a baby there. Which is fine. We like to have our baby animals hanging around. So you're good. Right, I think it's just the three of them. That should be fine then. Okay, I guess love our zoo. Yes, I know. We are a four-star zoo now. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Okay, let's, uh, let's get back to town here. Start working here. Oh, look at that. We got some people coming in. All right, good. We got people coming down this way. Good, 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 good. Excellent. Uh, you know, let's, uh, I think we should, let's find my water fountain. I think we should have a water fountain here. Koi, yeah, we can't throw the koi on dry land. That would be cruel and inhumane. Marine fountain. You know what? That might be a good addition for over here too, huh? Put the fountain right back behind here. Because this is going to be our marine area. So let's go. Let's throw our fountain down there. You know, now I think we can throw koi in here. Now I think we can throw the koi in here. Let's see. Let me see something here. If the koi will actually go in the fountain. That would be interesting if it would. No, he won't. Okay, let me see something. Will he go in the... Too shallow. Okay, so we need some deeper water if we're going to do koi. Let me see something. Will koi... Right here. Is this koi going to go in here? I think this is too shallow, too, is the problem. Daddy. What? I don't think there's anything that's... So I would have to dig a little deeper here. Why? So we can get koi. No. Let me, um... That would require terraforming. That could be a problem. Alright, so uh, we'll think about koi later. No. Uh, in the meantime, I want... This swore. No, no, Maybe the water fountain's it. here. You know, ATM. I should throw an ATM down here too, huh? No, today is a cold, windy day. It's a hot chilly, day. Chilly, chilly day. It's a hot day. Oh, it's a hot day for you? Okay. It's a cold day. It's a hot day. Is, that, I think, is that the touch pool? Daddy. Is this the touch pool here? That's a splash. I don't have a touch pool, do I? A touch pool would be nice uh, to go over here, too. Somewhere. I have to keep it. Because this, is where, let's do some marine. Do some marine stuff here. Oh no, I want. Uh, I want a water fountain. I don't know where the water fountain is. No, I, I'm pretty sure I placed one. So let's do. Let's see if I got one. I just gotta remember if. I placed one where I put it. Swore I had one down around here somewhere. Or you know what? It's, it's over here, isn't it? 
drinking fountain. There it is. That's what we want to do, drinking fountain. So we want a drinking fountain over here. I guess I'm going to have to throw out some more drinking fountains too. So we'll throw one there. Or put out, put up, build. The case may be here. So I don't see anything over on this side. Okay, good. So we'll put a drinking fountain here. Oh, I don't want that in front of our... We'll put one there. There we go. We'll put that fountain there. I think that's good. Maybe one over here at some point. Alright, that's good for now. Alright. Good. All right. So now we've got that. Um, hmm. Cold, rainy, windy here to only four Celsius, thirty-nine Fahrenheit with wind. Ooh, yeah, that is. It's not quite that bad here, but it is kind of chilly. It, it, it got kind of chilly when. Uh, when did we go to Hershey? Was that last weekend? last weekend already I worked this past weekend yeah it was probably last weekend then it was it was kind of chilly but enjoyable it was fun we had a good time probably our last trip to Hershey there no I don't want to go to Hershey anymore you don't oh well yeah it is yeah it is winter time for you guys up there I think yeah I think uh, I think you're a little bit more northern than where we are I'd have to look at the longitudinals again. But yeah, it's still technically for us, it's, we're still in autumn. Winter doesn't arrive for what, almost another month. I think, I think we're almost exactly a month out from uh, the official start of winter. But yeah, we, uh, we had some rain. It was actually, it was warm yesterday, even though we had a cold front coming through. Uh, I expected it to get chilly yesterday, but it really didn't. And today, that was a little bit chilly. But considering I, I spend time in a freezer that's on average 20 degrees below zero uh, throughout my day at work, it's really, <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of used to cold temperatures at this point. All right, so let's, uh, we got that good. Let's get some animals in here. Huh? No, I don't want to try that. Because I don't. I don't I don't like to eat oranges. No, you can't eat it. You can't eat the skin. It has to be peeled. Alright, here, give it to me. I have to get you a plate too. Or a bowl. Let's get you a bowl. I don't even know. Hmm, don't know where that went. I don't even know how to peel I don't know how to peel these things, abs. I need a knife. Okay. Not I need a sharp knife. Can you get me a sharp knife? Small one? Although I probably shouldn't be having you handle knives anyway. Here, let me, uh, here, I'll get it. Look out. I'll get it. I got it. Where's, where's the small You want to give it to me? Okay, here, do not, here, hold it by the handle, please, very carefully. Now give it to me. Thank you. There we go. I, I, not, oh, it's getting all over, isn't it? Oh, I almost poked you in the face. That would not have been good. All right, so what we're going to do, I'm just going to cut it. Can I try it? Yes, yeah, so let me cut it so can you can eat it. Do not, do not eat the skin because the skin is yucky. We gotta try new food because it might taste good. Yes, that's right. Daniel Tiger says we gotta try new foods because it might taste good. Maybe don't peek it down. Okay. You just don't eat the skin, okay? Where's the skin? The skin is the outside. You just eat this part, okay? 
I'm going to have this all, ooh, as it splurts all over the place. I'm not. All right, there you go. I had to try Be it. careful, yes. All right, let me clean my hands up. You got to do this before I'm streaming, Nabs. I, I was sitting all morning doing nothing, and you had no issues with wanting anything. I start streaming, and that's, okay, there we go. All right, good. The skin's the outside. This is the skin. Do not eat this. You can eat the inside, okay? So put it in your mouth and take a bite of the inside. Here, put it over here so it's out of my way. Thank you. You unplugged me. Okay, that's okay, Daddy. Oh, that's... There we go. I can't... Okay, we, it's it's me trying to plug myself back in because you unplugged me. Oh, <sighs> Jesus. No, 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 no. Don't eat the skin. Eat the inside. Here, put that part in your mouth. Now bite. There you go. Your mother should be here to do this for you. I, I can't handle it. You like it? Okay, that's what you eat. You don't eat the skin. <sighs> Rip headset users. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Folks, you can only see me walking indoor in the winter after a day outside of the park. You like mentioned walking house with only trousers. No, yeah, that's me. That's exactly what I do. Well, take a bite. I can't. I can't feed you. No, you then no. I can't. I can't help you now, Abs. You can do it yourself. You're three. You're over three years old. You've got no problem doing it yourself. Don't bite the skin. Here, you gotta hold it like this so you can bite that part. There you go. There you go. Okay, good job. All right, let's get on. Okay, uh, this guy dropped something right uh, where I'm going to start building. So let's uh, get down in here and dig. See what this is. Uh, do to do. Read higher, just above the stream elements. Oh wait! Oh wait! I gotta uh, let me do this. You want to practice your driving and parking? Look for yes, the Scania truck driving simulator. Uh, I do have that. Uh, because in fact, I, 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 whatever, whatever, it was a steam sale or something that, uh, I ended up getting a, a whole bunch of, like the Euro fishing, the bus driver, they all came in one big package. Ooh, oh, we had some birth out there. I can't stop talking. But yes, I, I do have that. And I, I actually look, I saw on the internet that it's, it's, it's pretty, it's a pretty good training simulation for the parking. And all that stuff, which I definitely need to do if I, I want to do some of the harder parking jobs. But yeah, I've got I don't have it installed yet because I just haven't had time to play it. Yeah, that's that's what I heard. Yeah, very useful for that stuff. What? I didn't eat the daddy. I didn't eat it, daddy. You didn't eat it? Okay, good. Wow, they're killing each other now. Lovely. So let's get rid of some mercats here. Yeah, I know you guys need space. You get you guys are terrible. You're absolutely terrible. Okay, so we're just gonna I'm just gonna adopt a whole bunch of out of here. Oh no, cave lines diseased. Oh Alright, let's uh Well, how can I heal you? Oh, you, oh you're sick. Um, oh, you know what? I, I have to get in here. That's what I have to do. Let's get in here. Stop walking! Huh? Got a sample from a cat with itchy symbols above its head. That's right, you're getting closer to finishing the cure. Okay. Um, it's making these cats itch. I don't know. Oh, take a sample from the scratching post. Cat scratch. Okay, cat scratch fever we got now. Okay. Okay, SSCS to make the game to promote Scania games organized by Scania themselves. And don't buy the truckers, huh? 
Interesting. All right, yeah, uh, renowned for its medical properties. Okay. Um, sounds okay. And yeah, doesn't unlock a cure. Um, Oh, okay, let's take a sample from that. Wait, right, come on here, hoping to see the press H. Search the desert's biomes for this plant. Okay. Came in here, just hoping for a nice relaxing hour or so. I think, is this a desert biome? And here I am, I got sick animals and everything else. Oh, okay. I think this is a savannah. I don't have a desert biome. So do I need to throw down the desert biome really quick here? But uh, hold on, this might be a desert. Let's see if this is a desert biome here. It's telling me nothing. Aloe vera. I bet you that might be what it is. So let me see if I can throw some aloe vera in there and see what happens. What? Um, hmm. I don't have any desert biomes. That's the problem. Let's get back in here. I know you guys are not. Alright, so let's just go. I don't care about rewards. I just want to. That well, That's what I thought, for God's sakes. So I put the aloe vera in there. Okay. All right, you're cured. How about you? You need to, yes. You still need to be cured here. Okay, I think they're cured. I, I, I think we did it. Okay. You guys are no longer sick. How about, how about baby cave lion here? Where are you at? There you are. 
Wow, well, there's a couple of them. Oh, look at that. All right, all right, you guys are good, and we got some aloe vera there for you. Why oh, that was aggravating. Okay. Like it's not aggravating, but that was stressful. <laughs> that was actually kind of stressful there. Holy mackerel. All right, let's go ahead and save this. Yes. Are you going to eat your orange jabs? Of course you are. You don't like it? Why not? Because why? Because you took a bite of the skin. I told you don't do that. Yeah. I just prefer orange juice. Works for me. Okay, so let's see. What were we going? What were we in the process of doing? Oh, yeah, throwing down some. Uh, going to do some marine mammals here. Uh, how much time we got left here? Uh, only a couple minutes. All right, let's see if I can get at least one tank exhibit build up over here. What happened to Cheetah 1? Cheetah 1 is supposed to be your mate, Cheetah 2. You're killing me. You're absolutely killing me. Game. Game's killing me. All right, let's go over here. All right. Yeah, we lost some fame. I know, I know. How is it not suitable for Velociraptor? Well, yeah. Um, okay. Um, it's not suitable because you're not in your biome. It's the second time you've escaped. How is that even possible? How are you getting out? I'm going to have to follow that thing around just to see how it gets out now. Alright, we'll worry about that later. Okay, let's, uh, let's throw in a marine exhibit here. Let's see. We got the beluga. Hey, we have a beluga. In fact, let's do show animals. Here we go. So we'll, we'll do some shows too. Orca, pilot whale, false killer whale, Pacific walrus, the sea otter, the sea lion, ball nosed dolphin. Yeah, you know what? Let's go. Uh, Um, let's start with the otter. Let's start with the sea otter here. This tank. All right, tank entrance. I gotta remember how to do this stuff here. So we'll go. We'll go another few minutes here till I can get this built, and then uh, we'll pop on over into uh, city skylines. Uh, tank wall. Opaque tank wall. Uh, we want the acrylic. So we're going to start, let's start you here. There we go. Okay. So there's our tank. Now let's, uh, of course, we need a tank entrance. Now let's put that over here. All right, we got that. Good, okay, good. All 
Right, so you don't have to worry about fencing. Fish. You cannot place fish in a what? <laughs> fish in a tank? Food box with fish, okay. Let me put that in there, okay. Alright, we'll stick with that. How, yeah, I was about to say, how we, what? We'll throw some squid in there too. We'll give them two food boxes down in there. Alright, so let's see what they like to play with. Oh, sea otters enjoy. Good. Well, we'll throw that in there. What else do you guys like? Okay, so we'll throw some of you guys in here too. So we got some of you guys. As a matter of fact, let me do this now too. I think I can throw this in here. Yeah, look at that. All right. So now we got you. Oh wow, that's kind of big. See how there's used as a resting place. Okay, okay. So we'll. Uh, Well, we put you right there. Okay. Oh, maybe not. I didn't want to square off that part of the tank. So that we put you right there. There we go. Okay. Oh, we're in the water. Okay, good. Let's get back here. See what else we got for you. We got that. No trees, obviously. Oh, we got some plants. Okay, let's see here. Green, giant green anemone. Kelp forest. Anemone. Uh -huh. Coral. On coastal grass. Um, there's some kelp in here along the back edge, I think, huh? We'll throw an anemone in here. There you go. We've got some kelp. We've got some anemone. Coastal rock. Maybe we'll just throw a small rock in there. We'll throw that in there. Okay, there we go. Okay. And of course, obviously, tank, water. So that's what we got there. All right, so let's do... Let's get our fellows adopted here. We'll adopt two of you. There we go. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Now I think I need a marine. I need a trainer. Shoes. Okay, so let's get a look okay, at he's doing the backstroke. Okay, so we got that. So let's get a trainer. Sea Outer 1, or Sea Outer 2. Okay, there we go. So you're training. 
Hey, he needs his resupply, okay. So you're gonna train him. Okay. Oh, I didn't look at that, that's fine. So you're training. How can you not fit prop into the tank? You're all wet. <sighs> well, that's a problem. You're not telling me whether it's what's wrong with it. All right, well, I guess I will have to fire you for now. Yes. Because you're not doing me any good. And I need to hire a zookeeper to take care of this son. So we'll ha hire another zookeeper to take care of some of our aquatic animals. So there you go. That's your assignment. Okay, so let's go. Why are you running away here? Hold on. Why are you running away? You just dive right in, don't you? Oh, look at that, then. Okay. We're good there. Uh, in the meantime. When else? Oh, yes. I need a donation box. So I remember the sea otters are in here. Come on, come on, come on. There we go, okay, sea otter. Sea otter, okay. That takes care of that. Got that, then we'll figure out training and all that. And a future episode, in the meantime, I think I'll do it. Uh, uh, that works for me. We get. Something accomplished, my goodness, it was hectic, but we, we, we got today in under a barrel. So good. So let's save this. Let's save this under this guy here. And we'll move on to City Skylines. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Oopsie Otter. Okay, so we got our first marine exhibit in here under our belt. Excellent. Then we can spend a couple hours here in City Skylines where we head on over to the Extra Life for Kids channel today for some more Atlas Reactor. We got a couple of missions to complete in Atlas Reactor. But in the meantime, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll be back again. I think we'll be back next week. I'm not sure. Again, it, uh, the schedule is going to be uh, sort of in flux, I think, on Mondays. But we'll see. Uh, well, we should be back maybe just not at this time next Monday. In the meantime, thanks for watching, everybody. It's BJ Wallace saying stick around. We'll be right back with these Skylines. Just got to flip games here real quick. And then we'll be back. But in the meantime, um, Super Velociraptor can't reach the food dish. But it can escape. It can escape the pen, but it can't reach the food dish. My goodness. Me, Tom. Thanks for watching, everybody. Until next time, I will see you in game.